Um, I have lots of fun at Field Fish Waterhouse. That sounds terribly cheesy, but it's a fun place. They're great at IP, technology, all things I'm interested in. But when I actually came into the firm, I think it was the, the people. You just need to look through our team to see that people have come from various different backgrounds um, and it's a place where you really do feel accepted from day one. It's a good mix of girls and guys and racial backgrounds. Here, part of my recruitment process was going for champagne and chips. <laughs> if you're a lawyer starting out, you've got 20, 30 years of work in front of you. You need to enjoy the work you do. I'm really, really looking forward to starting my career at Phil Fisher Waterhouse. It's genuinely a very ambitious firm. At work, I'm probably most passionate about learning as much as I can from as many people as possible. I started my role initially in an assistant role and I've now moved up within six months to an executive role. Uh, Phil Fisher is a really attractive proposition, I think. I've been here for 16 years. Uh, it's a really friendly place. It's not the sort of place, if you're, if you're looking for somewhere where you can work to one every morning, it's not your place. The atmosphere here is really relaxed, it's, uh, it's very professional but everyone's got their door open and it's a very friendly place. I've always had the opportunity to go on training, I've, um, I've only been here seven months and I've gone on one training course already um, externally and I've got another one lined up for May I think it is. In certain teams such as mine where it's quite a niche area there's scope for um, doing long distance postgraduate learning courses which are quite expensive but are funded by, by the team. To go back 20 years we were this corporate commercial firm. Now in 2013, we are probably the biggest tech and IP practice in Europe. Uh, and th that came out of a, an incredibly entrepreneurial streak. It's great to be able to work with household names that you recognize and often you'll see it in the paper, which is, is brilliant. It's, for example, some of the people I've worked with, be the BBC or, or Facebook, and they're, they're obviously names that everyone recognizes. We want people to get credit for the work they do. We want them to get out there and, and speak to clients. We want to encourage business development at every level uh, and that entrepreneurial spirit as well. Everybody, all the trainees get involved in the Queen Mary Lawfare work, which is a project we run with Queen Mary University. They bring in um, clients who want to use the Legal Advice Centre and then we go in as trainees to supervise the students there. That's a really good project and all of the trainees get involved in that. I think in terms of what we've got to offer to our recruits, uh, we do have the international dimension, so you can go to our overseas officers on comment there, but we do, we've got a lot of key clients where we're on panels uh, and we send people out on comment to big names. It's a really good opportunity to be able to go on comment because I think it gives you an experience of sort of the other side of the coin. You can make a huge impact if you join this firm. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to name check this person, but uh, we have a trainee who joined us a couple of years ago uh, and said, where is your LGBT group? Uh, we didn't have one. And it, we look back and think, why didn't you have one? Uh, he set it up from scratch. We now have a, an LGBT group that's not only thriving and networking uh, with clients and sort of setting the standard, but uh, clients like Vodafone have come to us to say, how have you made such a success of your group? And that's a trainee coming in that's done that.